Okay, taking a walk through White Plains, aka Hicksville. Evan Gold, though, I would figure that out. I mean, Evan Gold Transit would. So here we are, White Plains or Hicksville. Hicksville with a lowercase h. <laughs> and I am going to meet up with my friends. I mean, while I was at Mineola, I texted my girlfriend and asked if she was coming because she was, was a maybe on Facebook. <laughs> but mm, turns out she's not coming, unfortunately. So I've got a date in the week from now. <laughs> but this is just these intersections here. The way they work, they're just messed up. Very dangerous. <laughs> Same thing with newer shells like that too. All these one-way streets. It's easy to drive the wrong way down a one-way street if you're in your shell or right planes. <laughs> but I'm heading towards the city center. <laughs> Gotta wait. <laughs> version of Pixville, unlike Mineola where it's like, it has a village but it has a dead of transportation other than the railroad. Yeah, it's that bad. In, in the non-world area, Crestwood. So, it's still green but there's no more cars coming. That light ahead is red. We should be seeing some N22s and N24s, respectively that's 20s and 40s. <laughs> then there's the N20H, 5 bus. I don't know which route corresponds to the 13, but I looked up the Manhattanville College for like transfer credit for I mean, unfortunately, they don't have the degree programs I'm looking for. So taking the 13 there, doesn't matter if it doesn't go there, because I'm not going there. Mm -hmm. But further up the line, you'll see Pace University in Pleasantville, the same place that the successful learning center is in. That's where I'll be going once I have my associate's degree. Mm -hmm. I like how in Saratoga and in here, they have these rainbow crosswalks. I mean, the LGBT community matters. I don't like what the Republicans do. The Republicans hate Danger Force mainly because one a guy one of the guys looks like a girl, clearly one of the girls looks like a guy, clearly. And all four of the boys are steers. That's what they hate about that show. And here's the gallery where that Sears used to be. Who knows what's become of Sears now? <laughs> I mean, Sears, just 10 years ago in 2012, you'd see Sears close at, for the night, and then as they open in the early morning, they'd have a line, and there'd be lots of customers coming in. But just a few years after that, Sears was like having no customers. It was really that, the fall down, the fall of Sears is really that bad. Okay, that's, uh, where is that? I think that's, the end of it is then is the end four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
And then there's this place, the Gallery of White Plains. I'm trying to remember 12, 14, 16. Three times Game Boy was pierced there. The remaining two before that, I was pediatrician's office in Roosevelt Field and Garden City Park the second time at ages seven months and three years. And then the final time was, was further in, in Levittown there. Plains, Hicksville, mm -hmm. in the Levittown area, where the, where the Westchester is, or should I say, the Nassau. Mm -hmm. More people would think of that mall as the Sunrise Mall. Mm -hmm. The real Sunrise Mall has a five-star rating for ear piercing, too. Mm -hmm. So what do you know? The net heard for ear piercing and I got the cartilage, didn't hurt at all. Mm -hmm. I don't know which Suffolk transit route that corresponds to. But back to what I was saying about what could be done. But new, new technology development's coming for like for like instant piercing and easier like less painful tattoos. That I'm gonna get eventually. But you know my love for math and the reason why I want to major in college in math, get a degree in math. One thing that I might do is get a tattoo of a hyperbola. Mm -hmm. A hyperbola is two unbounded sides, one in one in one in quadrant one, one in quadrant three, and they can never intersect or interact with each other. Mm -hmm. Like an asymptotic story is like rising action climate climax being influ influent and it's infinitely climactic, like in Toy Story. That's what it is. That's why I've decided to put on my new loose hand. Right arm. I'm also going to get the hair that Tessan Chin had on the voice, the hairstyle. I'm working and revitalizing my hair. Also, also Amber Parenton from the previous season did try. She was wearing that same hairstyle. Amazing. This is like how you walk in such a urbanized Hicksville. <laughs> so let's talk about my, like, that type of plan. With all those piercings and tattoos. <laughs> Except after I, after I mentioned the uh, look and nose. Yeah. I don't know what the 13 amounts to in, in a nice bus. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I got all these crazy topics to talk about. That M the M7 I just got off of at White Plains, I would have transferred to a 40 bus this coming winter in spring when I take spring classes at WCC. First semester is going to be no credit, and the, the remainder at WCC and Pace will be for credit, but in a much modified program, similar to the president of the social group I've been, who did that at Pace. Mm -hmm. I've had some shakeups, they did avoid. Mm -hmm. Fourteen needs to run more often. So does fifteen, so does sixteen. 
they need to stop it with this new transportation plan to cut most of Beeline's only services in the north. Because we, they need more service more than we do down here in Southern Rochester. And I get why 1W is there, or W stands for White Plains, which is where we are. Don't be confused, think it should be 1H because it's not Hicksville here. We have the winter holidays coming up. These. These sprinklers have the colors on them. Yeah, the winter holidays we'll be doing a video about like how in the future all the presents I'll be getting for the winter holiday and my birthday which are very close together. They're all going to be used to manufacture things so it doesn't take up all the space by location. Here.